Very excited to cover that one, and I'm glad I was able to be there. Now on to another dogfight between two great programs, Abilene Cooper and Abilene High. Let me welcome in my superstar teammate, my guy, Sean Humphrey. Sean, you have been all over this rivalry there in Abilene. You were pumped for this one. Go ahead and fill us in on the game. Well, Damien, the excitement was warranted. The 64th Crosstown Showdown was a battle until the end. The Cooper Cougars lead the all-time series with 36 wins, but the Abilene Eagles, ranked 8th in Texas 5A Division 1, have won the last two matchups. Let's go ahead and look at the highlights. Here's the first quarter. It's Braden Henry rolling right, and the need for speed in Abilene strikes again. Henry high steps into the end zone, and I must be uncultured because I have no idea what to call this, but the young man has earned the right to flex. Later on in the first, Cooper taking the kickoff. The returner gives the Cougars good field position and does his best Superman impression, launching himself into midair. And unfortunately for Cooper, they wouldn't find a way to score vertically going the extra mile there. Braden Henry again uncorking the long pass, but unfortunately it's intercepted. He shot for the stars, but unfortunately ran into a constellation of Cougars and and Abilene Cooper would still have to wait until later. And later on, they did find a way to break into the scorecard. Xavier Alexander, who had two touchdowns last week, cutting through the defenders. It doesn't matter if it looks like the Eagles are going to catch him because they're not going to get him. He waves goodbye and tumbles into the end zone for a touchdown to tie the game at seven for both Abilene teams. Shotwell Stadium's going crazy. Braden Henry again, not dismayed by that interception, and he'll drop a dime to his wide receiver and future UTEP minor Ryland Bradford and this game was close until the end the final score 42 to 33 Abilene Eagles what a game Abilene wins its third consecutive crosstown showdown. They'll face historic Odessa Permian next week. Traveling Eagles fans will have about a week to wash down those <laughs> nails they must have been eating at Shotwell Stadium. But Damien, it doesn't stop there, does it? We've got a lot more to go here on Fox Football Live. Here we go, my a man. Let's keep it rolling. Sean,